Hello everyone. Um, as you can see, the CVX is badly in need of a wash. I won't be washing it at the moment anyway. I'll wait until I've... What it's going at doing, I suppose. And what it's going at is we're getting ready to go hedge cutting. Um, as you can see, it's a spearhead. It's mid-2000s, I would say. Um, it's a long reach model, so... That's about a 24 foot reach, and what I'm going, what I mentioned in the last video, I said we were after getting something for it. What we're after getting for it is this. Um, we got a new head for it. There was a bit of vibration in our old head, and it needed a few other bits and pieces done to it. So maybe the easiest decision. Not the cheapest, but maybe the easiest decision was to get a new head. Um, luckily, I knocked across this head. It was shop soiled. It was sitting somewhere for a number of years. And it has been unused, but it's not brand new. Several years old. So, that's what we have. Um, it's belt driven. Inside this cover here, is, there's a, a big belt. A belt is that thick. Um, opposed to multi belt, it's just a single belt. The old one was a direct drive, but there was a motor here, the motor was sticking out a bit, so it was fairly susceptible to being damaged. Now, um, I done a bit of grass cutting with it yesterday, yeah, we fitted it yesterday, and I done some grass cutting with it, and extremely happy with it to be fair. Um, nice, quite smooth head. We're going to change the flails, is what we're at today, because there was grass flails on it. Uh, as you can see them here now, they're just kind of a boot, boot flails, I suppose they're called, they're grass flails. But I don't think they'd be much good at actual heavy hedge cutting. Um, they're perfect in the grass, so they're meant for grass, but they weren't much good. They wouldn't be much good if you were going cutting heavy material. So what we're going to putting on are these. These are known as a competition flail. I didn't have competition flails on the last head. I had T flails. So it's my first time trying competitions. Um, the verdict is out on them by a lot of people. Some people say they're brilliant. Other people say the T's are better. Um, I know you have I think you've F14s and F10s and stuff like that in different flails. What I noticed about the T's that I had is they had a quite sharp spine on them here. And when they come back, they'd actually dig into the rotor and there'd be imprints of the flail in the rotor, which I didn't really like. I thought it was quite hard on the rotor. So I'm going to try these. They have a nice big back on them, a good spine on them. They're fairly strong looking. Um, people say they cut cleaner, so I think the opening date for the hedge cutting is Monday maybe, so we will know from Monday whether they're a success or not. Um, my hoses are slightly too long now, so I'll probably get them shortened. It's no disadvantage to have them that long, but when you are, if you're reversing and this gets caught in the hedge, there's a chance it could get sucked into the rotor, so... We don't want that, we want to try and avoid that if possible. Um, other than that, look that's the machine, there's not much to it really. Um, here's your telescopic part, it slides out here. There's another frame inside there and all that slides out, so you have a switch in the cab. It's joystick controlled, um, it's a nice enough hedge cutter to use now to be fair. It's, um, It'll be our, this will be our third year with it, I think. Yeah, I'd say it'll be our third year with it. So, look, I mean, we, we haven't done a haul pile. We didn't do a haul pile first year with it. Done a good bit last year with it now, to be fair. And um, hopefully this year we'll do even more. So, that's about all I can show you about the head. Um, I didn't film the grass cutting yesterday evening. It was just... Just a house, just cutting the lawn, an overgrown lawn of a house. But we got it done anyway. So um, I'm going to 
adjust my roller now because I have one flail to go off of and I know that roller isn't near low enough so I'm gonna drop that roller I'm gonna rip off all the grass flails because the tea flails will be here tomorrow sorry not the tea flails the competition flails will be here tomorrow um, so I'll be ready to stick them on so we'll have them on and we'll be ready to go for when the season opens and we shall get cutting so that's it for the moment thanks very much for everybody that's watching um, please give them a like subscribe to the channel and we'll see you for the next edition